Shalom, we the Hebrew Israelites. We come here week in and week out to prophesy the downfall of this wicked, sinful kingdom, aka America, aka uh, Babylon the Great, aka Rome, Egypt. Okay, but first and foremost, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Kakadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone for teaching us the 100% truth according to the Bible and who will well. Double shalom to all you Akim and you Akwa, those of the hopeful let that are seeking for salvation. All right? Like we always do, the water, my brother. Like we always do, we want to introduce the real 12 tribes of Israel. You got Judah, the so called Negroes, Benjamin, the so called West Indians, Levi, the so called Haitians, Simeon, the so called Dominicans. Zebulon, the so-called Guatemalians to Panamanians. Ephraim, the so-called Puerto Ricans. Manasseh, the so-called Cubans. Uh, Gad, the so-called North American Indian tribes. Reuben, the so-called Seminole Indians. Yeah, you with us, you with us. Um, Reuben, the so-called Seminole Indians. Nephali, the so-called Argentinians and Ch Chileans. Asher, the so-called Colombians to Uruguayans. And last but not least, Issachar, the so-called Mexicans. If you see yourself on a sign according to the city of your father, repent because instruction is at hand. Right, that's right. right. That's the only thing that's coming through the spirit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah that, that, that's what's coming, man, through the spirit of fire. Y'all about to my shot. Destruction, man. Matter of fact, it's a good thing to The Amos 9 and 8. Uh. And let the spirit flow wherever the spirit want to go into. Right. You know? Because here we in the year 2022. And things ain't gonna get better. It's only gonna get worse, man. So that's what you can expect for 2022. Alright? 2022 is about to make 2021 look like a cakewalk, man. contrary to the Bible, man, all right? Like our brother Ra was going into that, the brother Kabbalah posted up, he was passing uh, 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 unrighteous decrees, man. Now, what do you think is going to happen if you keep uh, passing unrighteous decrees? That sudden destruction is going to come, man. So that's what you can expect. He's on. Hey, Moses. Let me, let me bring this preacher right quick. Uh, the brother mentioned something. Oh, boy. We're going to jump right back. All right. Isaiah. 10 and 1. Yeah. Right back. Uh-huh. Let me get it. Do some water alert. It's all good, brother. That's what you guys got to 
expect in 2022, man? Destruction, man. Isaiah 10 and 1. Yep. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees. That word woe means destruction. So destruction unto those that pass our righteous decrees, man. Mm -hmm. Our decree is a law. Yep. So they're promoting and they're passing laws that are contrary to the Bible. Mm -hmm. So destruction is going to come for that, man. Right. That's why America, a.k.a. Babylon the Great, is crumbling as we speak, man. Know, right? It ain't getting no better. It says, and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. Right, that right grievousness, man. Because all the laws that they pass, man. You know, it, it, it's grievous, it's burdensome, man. Yep. With the taxes, yep. you know, alimony, mm -hmm. you know, uh, child, child support, support yep. yep. You know, all that, that's that's burdensome, man. And they prescribed it, they wrote it, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, you know, and, and, and Yahweh Shimon Shah is going to have a judgment for the elites for doing that, man. Uh -huh. That's why they're going, that's why they're going to be the first fruits of slavery in the kingdom of heaven, man. What's up, bro? Oh, you good, bro. Something bad, very severe or serious. Yeah, you know these, these laws they pass are, are something yeah. bad. It's not good. It's not. It's not uh, beneficial for yeah. your life. For your life. Sure. You know it, everything it does. These laws that these devils push is contrary to life. It's contrary to life. It, it promotes death. So yeah, they're they're making it mandatory for you to drink the juice. Yeah. But what does the juice do? It cause you to do? Yeah. You know, and it, it's putting a lot of people to death. Yep. But he, this is this is this devil for you, man. Yep. That you've been, our people have been trusting in. The next is gonna be that MOTB, man. Uh -huh. And you know what's gonna happen in the course of Revelation 14 and 9. If you take that, it's gonna be nothing but pure uh, destruction, man, mm -hmm. from the Lord. It says uh, just a little bit on, uh -huh. a little bit more. Uh -huh. Isaiah 10 and 1, and their right grievousness. Which they have prescribed. Right, what they allow, man. That's what prescribed means. They allowed it. They passed it, man. Yep. They written it down, yep. and then they then they passed it. You know, and said it was okay to uh to, to, to bring it out. Uh -huh. All right, to to uh to make it a mandate. You no, know? that's this devil for you, man. And the word devil means deceiver. That's right. But that's what he is, man. He's just the the, the nation of Edom, the so-called white race, nothing but a bunch of uh, uh, uh devils, man. That's right. Amos <clears throat> chapter 9 verse 8 Behold the eyes of the Lord power are upon the simple kingdom. Right, in the, the simple kingdom, man, they pass our righteous decrees. That's why the Spirit had the brother bring it out. Okay? All the wicked decrees, all the wicked laws that they pass, man, and they think it's okay, you know, they got an answer for that, man. And the ones of our people that are down with the system, they're gonna be destroyed right along with it. Mm -hmm. It reads on, and I will destroy it from off the face of the earth. Yeah, how about Shemar Shah said he's going to destroy this place from off the face of the earth. Mm -hmm. how, how is he going to do that? By way of fire, man. Mm -hmm. By way of those nukes, the ICBMs, and the laser beams from the chariots with the word we call UFOs, man. This place is going to be a complete desert, according to the Bible. A desolate place, man. It reads on. Saving that I will not <clears throat> saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, saith the Lord. Yeah, the Lord said, except I'm not going to destroy all the house of Jacob, man. Meaning because he got the elect. Okay? The elect is going to be delivered up out of here, man. Whoever they may be, and we're hoping to be a part of that number. To get that salvation, to get that rescue. Or to be raised up first when he returns, man. Right. You know? It's all, it's all uh, honorable, man. And that's what we want through the spirit. Y'all doing that? Yeah. Uh, you had something else? Yeah, I got a free, I got a free stuff. What you got, brother? Uh, the book of Jeremiah 51 and 6. Flee out of the midst of Babylon. Right, which is spiritually, man. All right, meaning coming out of the mind state of Babylon the Great, man. But that's what it's talking about. It's talking about this place right here, thinking as an American, man. Mm -hmm. All right? And what is uh, uh, my city of America is doing right now? They, they drink a cup to that spotty juice, man. Yeah, yeah. All right? Complying with the system. And if I could just say, we uh -huh. just read that um, 
Lord can ready to restore the simple kingdom off the face of the earth. Yep. You know? It says, and deliver every man his soul. Be not cut off in her iniquity. Right, because iniquity is a sin upon sin, man. Yeah. So all the wickedness that goes on here in America, Babylon the Great, Yahweh Shimon Shah is going to pay this place, pay this place back, man. All right? So we do all that, uh, save every man from his soul, scriptures, man. Right. You know, if Yahweh Shimon Shah allows him to wake up and receive the understanding of the Bible. Man. It says, um, it says, for this is the time of the Lord's vengeance. Right, this is the time of the Lord's vengeance, the times that we're living in now. All right, the last days of the last days, man. We're at the end of this thing, you know? The finish line is right there, man. I know, right? All right? So this is the time of Yahweh Bashim is about to repay this place back for all the things that they did to the nation of Israel. He will, so like it, Jeremiah 51 and 6, read it on. He will render unto her a recompense. He will render, remit, uh, uh, bring back a recompense unto her. Who is that her? Babylon the Great, man. Right. All right? So all the rape, all the robbery, all the murder that happened here in this land, man, the Yahweh Bashim is going to pay these people back, man. Okay? Second Timothy chapter 3 verse 1. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come. Right, and we're living in those times now, man. And it's only gonna ramp up. Okay? And perilous meaning dangerous. Okay, bad times, man. And that's what we're seeing, man. 2022 already done kicked off with a bang, man. Alright? With the death of a stop. Alright? So already done kicked off with judgment, man.